Rikia, as hard as it is to believe, this is your first NCAA tournament. Just how excited are you personally and for Tennessee? Oh, I'm very excited with this being my first tournament and for us to be able to host with this being my first tournament. Um, I feel like we're going to make a lot of noise and, you know, continue to do the great things that we've been doing. So I'm very excited. Obviously, you knew you guys were in when you were watching the show, but when you saw Tennessee on the screen, you know, it said in that you're going to play your first tournament. What was going through your head? What were your emotions like? Oh, it was just excitement. Like, I'm just so proud of this team. So, like, how much we've overcome and being able to be in this position, it's just, it's just a blessing in itself. And... Um, I'm just so proud of us, yeah. What is this number four scene a reflection of? Um, it's just a reflection of overcoming, you know. We were so tough, overcoming a lot of adversity this season. For us to pull out a four seed, that just says a lot about our team. And um, like, again, just so proud of us. How important is the four seed to have a turf advantage for you guys? Yeah, I think that's very important. Like, who wouldn't want to play in front of their amazing fans, especially us? You know, we have the best fans in the country, so. We're just excited to do that. Rakia, you and Justine, when the bracket first came up and you saw Tennessee, but it was Tennessee Tech, <laughs> the two of you both, your eyes just got deep. Did you not see the Tech part? No, all I saw was Tennessee, and I was just like, uh, because, you know, I don't even know how this stuff works, how it looks. You know, me and Coach Kelly was talking after practice the other day, and I'm just like, what is this? Like, how does it work? Are we all in one big place, like the SEC tournament? Like, do we go places? So... Um, that's just me not knowing, never playing in this um, tournament. So, but I was my heart dropped a little bit. But you know, I'm glad that wasn't us. You talked about it a little bit before, but with the four seed, the committee really rewarded you guys for your tough schedule. How nice is it to see all of that pay off right now? Yeah, it means a lot for us to see it pay off. You know, going through those losses is hard, but when you see the reward after, it just means so much more. And of course we wanted to, to win those games, but we played all four of the number one seeds before. So that's just good for us to even have that under our belt. What will you carry with you throughout this tournament? Obviously it being your first time, maybe the last time too. What will you carry with you? Um, I'm just going to carry grit, like having fun with this team, cherishing every moment, not taking any moment for granted, and um, just having fun with it. Rakia, when this team was four and five in November, it would be hard to envision a number four seed today. How did y'all never lose hope? How did you stay together? I'm um, just sticking together and us believing in each other. At the end of the day, we knew the team that we could be. We knew we had to overcome so much. So we just stuck together and it was tough. It was really tough because there were times where we were just like, oh man, like this is hard. But you know, we stayed tough. We stayed healthy. We all took accountability for everything. So that's what made us stronger. And, you know, obviously that LSU upset certainly helped you guys in getting the four seed. What has that done for the team psyche to have notched that ranked win, especially to take down LSU? Yeah, it just gives us confidence. You know, like we always say, it's always hard to beat a team twice. But we just knew we didn't want to make the same mistakes that we made the first time that we played them. So we definitely just had a short memory in that game. Even though we were down, like we were like, you know, we're still going to win this game. We're still not out of this until the clock says zero. How different does this team feel today than it did you know, two, three months ago? It feels totally different. Just the energy, the confidence that we have. I feel like we've always been confident, but we actually know like we can really compete with the top teams. We know the depth that we have. We know what each player can do. So I feel like we just have so many weapons and we just have to continue to stick together because our chemistry is only getting better. Rakia, this is your fourth spring break of college, <laughs> but your first one with basketball. How yeah. nice is it to not have a spring break with us? no basketball oh man um it's cool of course you know i'm gonna be at home get to stay in knoxville um probably go shopping or something the day before the game that always helps so um it's, it's pretty cool are you live streaming oh yeah i was on live <laughs> yeah Anything yeah, they all were just like, you know, ESPN hating on y'all or let this be fueled because they didn't show us on the screen. So I'm glad I went live because I thought they were going to show us, but I'm just glad I went live for the fans so they could see our reaction and things like that. So, um, yeah, they were just being funny, trying to say, can you get Coach Kelly to dance? I got her to dance. <laughs> so they were they were um, cool, though. Our fans are always supporting us. Can you rate Kelly's dance Final skills? Question. Where are they? I will have to give Coach Kelly a solid seven. She has rhythm, but the energy, like she had it, but she just needed a little bit more oomph. She got it though, she got it. She can be a 10 by the end of this um, tournament for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Love the high hopes. <laughs> All right, thanks for